Ralph, to me you haven't passed. Your spirit and your incredible gift for remembering everything about every generation of every member of the Korean American pioneers was so exquisite. You stood at the podium and you named everybody where they were, went to school, what they were doing, their careers, their children, grandchildren. How will we ever replace that? Who will step up? Who can fill your shoes? Nobody. But we have to try because I know that's what you would want us to do. Who knew that when my grandfather, Hyun Soon, and your father, An Chan Ho, were Minister and Vice Minister of Foreign Affairs, that you and I would be in America in Los Angeles celebrating their courage and their accomplishments and Korea's success as an independent country. I'm gonna miss you so much, friend. And Annie, I love you so much. And thank you so much for your loving support. God bless you. Hi, my name is Colin Kim. And on behalf of myself and my family, we wanna wish our deepest condolences to Ralph's family and also to beautiful Anna Teresa. Uh, Ralph was neighbors and also best friends with my grandparents, Yin and Winifred Kim. And, you know, growing up, my immediate family, we didn't have a tangible or uh, close uh, understanding of our Korean ancestry. And it was Ralph's uh, sharp humor and his incredible memory um, that, and it also an invitation to participate that made um, my direct connection to our predecessors, my great grandparents, Sung Kwon Kim and Hai Won Kim, um, something the photographs jumped off the paper uh, with real personalities that we could experience and uh, feel. He was always interested in making sure that we understood the creativity and the big hearts um, of our direct descendants. And my family and I were so thankful uh, for who Ralph was to us and also so many people. We know that our experience with him was not unique and uh, anybody would be so lucky uh, to have Ralph's character and dignity. Uh, we loved him and we're gonna miss him so much. Uh, Abojiga, 시간이 가고 또 가실 분들이 가시는 것에 대해서는 막을 수가 없지 않습니까? 더 중요한 것은 남은 사람들 그리고 후대 사람들이 어떻게 그 뜻을 유지하고 발전시키는가가 굉장히 중요한데 오늘 참여하신 여러 분들이 단체와 개인들이 있는 형편 가운데서 어떻게 하면 도산 정신을 계승하고 발전시킬 수 있을 것인지를 진지하게 고민하고 또 실행할 수 있는 귀한 계기가 되었으면 참으로 고맙겠습니다. 고맙습니다. 한인 사회 큰 바위 얼굴이다 이렇게 묘사하고 싶고요 그분은 항상 그 웃는 얼굴의 미소로 또 다정한 목소리로 한인 사회 각종 모임에 참석하실 때마다 제일 먼저 어 일착으로 오시고 많은 사람들과 인사하시고 또 다정한 어 표정으로 많은 사람들을 포용한 분이다. 이제 하늘나라에서 유복자로 이 세상에서 계속 한평생 가슴 아리가 있었을 텐데 도산 아버님과 함께 만나서 얼마나 기쁨을 나누실 수 있을까 그러한 마음으로 어 안심이 되기도 하네요. 라우판 선생님의 업적과 생각을 이어가기 위해 아, 뿌리 교육에 어, 열정을 쏟으신 것처럼 많이 기여해 주신 것처럼 어, 그 후손들에게 한인 2세들에게 3세, 4세들에게 한인 정신과 어, 그 독립투사의 정신을 이어가도록 노력하겠습니다. 랄프 선생님께서도 아버님인 
도산스님의 뜻을 이어받아서 당신께서 언제나 한인에서든 어디서든 당신의 도움이 필요한 곳이나 당신이 필요한 곳에는 언제나 제일 먼저 달려가셔서 도움을 주시고자 하셨습니다. 어, 저희 같은 전통 문화를 개성해 가는 우리들도 어, 스님처럼 저희들이 필요한 곳 어디나 도움이 필요한 것은 언제나 저희도 솔선수범하여 먼저 달려가서 저희들도 도움을 드려야겠다라는 그런 생각을 합니다. 여생을 돌아가실 때까지 흥사단과 이 국민회와 우리 모든 애족 애국 단체들의 행동과 하실 때마다 나오셔서 끝까지 참석해 주시고 과거에 있는 우리 여기 동포들의 후손들, 애국애족 후종들의 모임에 항상 참석하셔서 저에게 3.1절 행사를 대한민국 국가를 부르는 토렌스의 모임이 있다고도 알려주셨고 이제 도산 안창호 선생님을 배로 떠나셨습니다. 랄판 선생님은 자라면서 아버지의 얼굴을 보지 못하고 자랐지만 부친의 영향을 받아 살아계시는 동안에 대한국민회에서 많은 활동과 차세대 역사 가르치기 운동 에, 또한 그 파이널 소사이티에서 많은 업적을 통해서 남가주 한인사에서는 존경받는 인물이었습니다. 그분은 떠나셨지만 도산 안창호 선생님과 에, 그분의 업적은 에, 우리의 가슴 속에서 살아 숨쉴 것이며 영원히 기억될 것입니다. 랄판, 랄판 선생님의 에, 고귀한 인생 노정에 다시 한번 감사드립니다. 어, 어디 그 동포사회에 가실 때는 통역이 필요한데 저희 남편이 에, 통역 학교에서 동시 통역 가르치기도 하고 그 일이 그런 일이어서 마침 잘두 분이 잘 어, 맞아가지고요 어, 어디 가시든 어디를 가시든지 라판 선생님이 저희 남편 어, 김구원님 어, 배니어 항상 배니어 같이 가기를 원하셨는데요 어, 사람들이 전부 아주 어, 두, 두 분이 너무너무 잘 맞는다 그랬어요 랄판 선생님의 유지를 받들어서 이 미국 사회에서 여성들이 유리 천장 깨기와 여성들의 신장을 위한 노력을 할 것이며 랄판 선생님과 앤 사모님의 그 따뜻한 사랑을 저희가 본받아서 저희 가정에도 따뜻한 사랑이 깃들 수 있도록 모범을 보여주신 모든 것 감사드리며 랄판 선생님의 명복을 빕니다. My father was uh, very instrumental in my life. He was my my hero, my world, my best friend, and most of all, he was a teacher of example of how to walk through life gracefully. Um, anytime I had a problem, I would go to him, and he would always take time out to teach me to do the right thing. His advice, his opinions were so important to me. Uh, we were blessed to have him as long as we had him, and uh, he was a fighter, he was a strong man, he was a funny man, he was a humble man, he was a very simple man with a big, large world. Uh, Ralph was my grandfather. Uh, he was more like my father. Um, you know, he taught me everything, how to be a man. And um, I'm just glad that I got to have him in my life this whole time. And especially my son. My son's six years old, and I'm glad that my son got to be in his life for the six years. And, you know, just everybody had a nice relationship. And uh, that, that just was more meaningful to me. So I could see, I could use all the tools that my grandfather gave me to show him how to be a man. And um, <laughs> I just, you know, thank everybody that's uh, here and my family and friends. And uh, thank you. What I loved about my grandpa was that we would always go out to dinner every Saturday night and we loved going to Korean restaurants and he was a father figure to me and I enjoyed, his, uh, I enjoyed helping him when he was sick. I really love him. Thank you for coming to his funeral memorial. 
Okay, there are many things I loved about Ralph, but after thinking of all the things that he taught me, it seemed like communication was very important to him. He made sure every day when we started the day and had our coffee that we would sit down and talk about what we were going to do, how everybody in the family was. We talked to politics and it made a life very enjoyable. And all I got to say is after 49 years, there are so many things I could say but that is my important thing, that he believes in communication. And I just want to say thank you for everybody that has helped me through this bad time in my life. And uh, so thankful for the Korean organization to help us put this memorial on. And that's, that's it. No more? No more. <laughs>